The Ministry of Agriculture and Lands, Fisheries and Cooperatives is collaborating with the University of the West Indies and the Food and Agricultural Organization towards managing agricultural production via training. The training cost-effective risk management options for agriculture and livelihoods comprises two components, a theory session at the National Stadium and a practical aspect at the Mirabeau Propagation Station. The sessions showcased techniques for optimal fertilizer application, compost building and livestock feeding to extension assistance and crop and livestock farmers. According to Ministry of Agriculture's representative Gregory Del Sol, the significance of this training is knowing the alternative approaches to the methods currently being used. UE um, provided us with these three facilitators, Dr. Rudoxi leading the team. That would give us a lot of cost-effective measures that we could do in terms of compost building, um, proper fertilizer applications. Because a lot of times in this country, farmers tend to waste fertilizer. We, can, we put more fertilizer than we need to actually apply to the crops. Number two, we need to, he also talked about soil testing. We need to do that a, a bit more so we know exactly what the soil needs, not just apply, um, by guesswork. Dr. Gios Yudoxi, Senior Lecturer of Soil Science at the University of the West Indies, together with Dr. Martin Hughes, an animal production specialist and nutritionist, highlighted the composition of the resources and how best to manage them efficiently. So I think we were able to provide some very low-hanging fruits, including, for instance, understanding how a simple thing like where you place your fertilizer and how much of that fertilizer you use uh, is so critical for being efficiently. And similarly, on the side of the feeds, I think we were able to show that when you are creative and you think about the alternative um, feed substrates that are available, you can, particularly for ruminant animals, produce a more reasonable cost substitute for what we already have on the market. One of the major areas, I think, is the improvement in our productivity. One of the, the, the sore points for us in terms of our production is that we are very low in terms of where our, um, the yield potentials of most of our crops are. And by changing very slight practices, there's a great opportunity for us to increase that. These strategic measures are aimed at improving the efficiency of both farmers and extension assistants. Brenda Phillip, extension assistant, and Kenneth Charles, a farmer, says the training they received was a source of empowerment to them. We learned very much about the deep um, placing the fertilizer into the soil instead of on the surface as we normally do. Um, and we were shown the, the advantages of, of doing that. Because for example, fertilizer left on the surface in hot sun, most of the nitrogen would vaporize. So before the plant could get it, you would have lost most of it. So when you cover it into the soil, it, it is there for a longer while and more accessible to the plants. Mission relating to not just soil fertility, but building your soil and helping the farmer to understand what he needs to do to improve his soil condition for better production and also to enhance the fertility in terms of delivering the, all the minerals and the, the required nutrition that the plant would need um, to survive and to produce in a healthy manner. Christina John, GBN News.